the Humber Gym reached full capacity for the highly anticipated Humber versus Sheridan rivalry game. This matchup is considered by many as the fiercest rivalry in the CCAA. Last night, the Hawks hosted the Bruins in the 105th edition to end the regular season. The women's team started off the night. The score was close in the first quarter, but the Hawks managed to completely shut down the Bruins' offense in the second. Humber racked up 19 points while holding Sheridan to only one basket made. Their lead quickly shrank when the Bruins came out hot in the third, outscoring Humber 24-8. to The Bruins continued their comeback in the fourth quarter, taking their first lead of the game. Humber fought back with Maya Campbell-Johnson delivering five straight points to get back the lead. Campbell Johnson picked up her third straight double-double and fifth of the season with a career-high 15 rebounds to match her 15 points. It was an intense final two minutes. The Hawks down by two until Janae Giles knocks down a three, forcing the crowd on their feet for the final seconds of the game. An unfortunate foul for Humber gave Sheridan two free throws, putting them up by one with just five seconds left to play and no timeouts. Off the inbound, Giles passes the ball to Amber Bouchard, who delivers a contested layup at the buzzer, giving Humber the win 64-63. to It was a storybook ending on seniors' night as both graduating athletes Giles and Bouchard contributed greatly to the win. Fans continued to pour in for the men's game. There were people sitting, standing, and even viewing from the fitness center upstairs. <laughs> It was back and forth in the first quarter, but both men's teams picked it up in the second quarter. Kevin O'Toole was big coming off the bench, picking up seven points, four rebounds, two assists, and one steal in the quarter. I think we just played as a team, used coaches' strategies, and just played our brand of basketball and used each other, just hype each other up. Whoever's down, pick them up, and we had the energy, so we just came out with the W with that. Humber managed to take the lead going into the half, 52 to 46. Sheridan retook the lead in the third until back-to-back -back threes for Humber put them back on top going into the fourth. It was all tied up at 83 with just under four minutes left in the game. Cy Samuels and Jalen Morgan made consecutive baskets to extend their lead to take the win 101 to 93. I was having fun at the end. Um, I think I was a little bit nervous at the beginning of the game, so I finally started to break out a little bit. And uh, had some fun. Uh, they gave me some opportunities, so I was able to chip away at it at the end, which was good for the team. It helped us a little bit in the win. This game marks the final regular season home game for graduating players Daquan Cascart, Jalen Morgan, Cy Samuels, McQuell Martin, and Khaled Adam. The crowd was overflowing with fans at the Hawks Nest tonight for the last home game of the season. It was an exciting night as both the women's and men's team came out with a win in the end. Since this was the last home game, next up we have Nationals, which will also be hosted at Humber. I'm Paige McGowan for Humber News.